What's good, it's Jigozi. It's Wednesday, December 14th, 2022. But on December 13th, yesterday, this guy, Twitch, Steven, boss, he's Ellen DeGeneres' DJ. He was sacrificed by the Society of Jesus. And I'll show you how. So the Society of Jesus, they are within the Catholic Church. They believe that God created the world, created the letter with a number, it's all Kabbalah. So since God created this world with this letters and numbers, Kabbalistic system, right? They interpret that and also play God. And essentially a spiritual practice of them is to do this Kabbalah, this Gematria, numbers and letters. This is really how the people who run Hollywood, which are the Jesuits, this is how they actually do it. So his name, Stephen Boss, right, equals 56. Right? Stephen Boss 56, like Society of Jesus. Right? And also 43, like Killing. Society of Jesus. Right? So Society of Jesus equals 56. They are the Jesuit order. The Jesuit order equals 201. And I saw Zach Hubbard from Gamacha Effect News posted this on Twitter. How this guy died 201 days from the ending of the Ellen DeGeneres show. And this is Ellen DeGeneres, her show is called the Ellen DeGeneres Show, right? This is all synced up with her in the show. And the last episode, May 26, 2022 is when the show ended, right? May 26, 2022. So you do May 26 to December 13th to see what you get, right? May 26, 2022. 201 days. 201 days. So do you see how his name equals 56 and he's dying 201 days from when the show ends? That's how you know that it's the Jesuit order involved. There's many other reasons. This is their language, their calendar, the Gregorian calendar named after a pope. They made this modern English. It all rolled out around the same time. And throughout history, many people have been speaking out against these people and letting you know what they're responsible for. So the Jesuit order are responsible. You clearly see here with the Gamatra, this is what they do. And of course it doesn't end there. Ellen DeGeneres, her birthday, January 26, 1958. And interesting, interestingly, she has the same birthday as Kevin McCarthy, the GOP Speaker of the House, who was just put into, put into office, installed, because he's just another agent. So he was on the front page news yesterday and that was the same day this guy died. So, you know, they, they sync up the politics with entertainment. It's all the same thing with the sports. It's all the same thing. So I wanted to call that out as well. But, yeah, the day Kobe Bryant died is her birthday. And from her birthday to from when he got, this guy died is 44 days, right? So he died December 13th till her birthday is 44 days. Kill 44. African American equals 44 as well. Black people, 44. Sacrifice, 62. So with the sacrifice, 62, six weeks, two days, and 44 days. These are the numbers used in his rituals all the time. Kill, 44. Sacrifice, 62. From Ellen DeGeneres' birthday. And right now she's 64 years old right now. So they made sure to kill her DJ when she's 64. Kill equals 64 and 44. You see this? This is how they actually do this. Steven Twitch Boss. This guy was sacrificed by the numbers. His birthday is September 29th, 1982, right? He was born then. This, that, well, now they changed it. It's funny. I was on Wikipedia earlier. It was December 13th. But now I'm back. It's December 14th. This is what they always do. Let's see if it's on the, on the search page still. This was, this was literally December 13th, and I'm back here it's December 14th. So I didn't get it wrong. They put December 13th there. So I was thinking, okay, maybe he died the 13th. They're making it news 14th, which is what they do a lot. But no, they're always changing birthdays. Giving the, they're giving you the runaround. You know, it's just the same. Can I, can I go back? No. So they just updated it now. It's ridiculous. Let me type in Stephen Boss. So if anyone's seeing the, thir the uh, they're not, so they changed it. But oh well, we'll do the 14th in with all my dates again. But it's whatever, that's fine. 
They always change the dates all the time. We can see when this was last edited. Yeah, they edited it like three minutes ago. 705 UTC. I was like, I'm sure that was a few minutes ago. So here you go. So. So let's go. So yeah, so it's 201, 201 days from his birth. Oh, look, see, this is what they're doing. See? I get it now. And that's why Zach shared. I see Zach. I'll show you. We'll go to his, his blog. Cause we, if, if, if there's anything we're going to do, we're going to we're going to expose how Wikipedia changes information. Again, we exposed it yesterday, how they changed when Cincinnati was incorporated to a city. See, Zach, Zach's talk, so, so I'm not wrong. Zach did the, because Zach read the code of this. See, December 13th, because this is what they had. Now they changed it to the 14th. See, the DJs did it at 40, DJ equals 40. The DJs did it at 40, DJ equals 40. And since he's dead at 40, it, mu it means he died in his 41st year of his life. Ellen's show equals 40 and 41. And he's dead at 40, died at the 41st year of his life. He died in Ellen's 322nd day of her age, the 46th week of her life, of her age. Sacrifice equals 40, 46. The Skull and Bones, 322. Sacrifice, 46. So... 201 days from when the show ends, like Skull and Bones 202, or in 201, the Jesuit Order 201, and the news breaks 202 days later, and now they say he died on this day as well. Order of Illuminati 201. And then N. Heck, she also died, and they, and they killed her on this, on this kill date as well. In, the, in this case, the death of Stephen Boss comes 44 days before Ellen's upcoming birthday while she is still 64 years old. 44, 64. See? 44 days from her birthday. She's 64 years old. These are things I was, I was just talking about. If you weren't paying attention earlier or you just joined the video or whatever. And then they killed Anne Heck. And this is 121 days later. Like Blood Sacrifice 121. So, see? See right? See this? This is Wikipedia. So Zach copied this from Wikipedia. So we're just we're just documenting, we're documenting how Wikipedia changes information. Chadwick Boseman died at forty-two, then they changed it to him dying at forty-three, because it was so obvious. They always do this to confuse people, to annoy us, to mock everyone. It's bullshit. So again, you see, this is Wikipedia before, and now they changed it to the oh, it's actually the fourteenth. Stupid as fuck. So again, if you're if you're new to this, because I know these are my most popular videos, at least we're documenting this. If you, if you still can't get what these people are doing, despite the good decodes, at least know that they're still messing with you, changing the dates. But again, you should be understanding more than than that right now. That this is all a mockery. It's all a ritual. He died on his 76th day of his age, like slave, Negro, blues, Rasta, blood sacrifice. Slaver eighty seven one hundred two like Stephen think about the you know the black numbers in his name dead fourteen n fourteen killing forty three news breaks on the fourteenth his name is Stephen Boss which equals forty three murder and Twitch his nickname is Twitch murder and Twitch equal the same thing these are all Zach's notes I'm going off of but I came to, to look for the December thirteenth and bam Twitch murder. I mean, do you not get what they're doing? <laughs> so you think, they even talk about So You Think You Can Dance, which is 263 to 56 Prime, like Stephen Boss, 56, Black Lives Matter, 56, Society of Jesus, 56. So You Think You Can Dance, 106, like Black, 106, and Black Lives Matter. He rose to fame on So You Think You Can Dance. So, so that's how the, the entertainment world works. This guy got his fame from a show that equals the same thing as Black Lives Matter. You know what I'm trying to say? And he's a black person. But obviously to this gang, none of these people's lives matter. They only matter when they're alive. You have to use them. So that's really the decode. I, I wanted to, because I was going to decode Steven's birthday to when he died, and then I saw the 14, I was like, what? But it's still relevant, because that's when the news came out. But again, his birthday, September 29th. Seventy-six days. 
10 weeks, six days, you know, Black 106, Black Lives Matter, so you think you can dance, don't you get what they do? This is what I'm talking about. He dies 10 weeks, six days from his birthday, and they said he rose to fame on what? So you think you can dance. So you think you can dance. 106. They always like to do this thing. The numbers of what they came to, to fame for are used ritualistically in their deaths. And again, with this Gregorian calendar, all from the Catholic Church. So thanks a lot, Zach, for putting this information together. I'll, I'll link that in the description. And we're going to just look at this stupid-ass article from CNN. You know, Black 11 up to the 110. They said Ellen DeGeneres heartbroken over death of Stephen Twitch boss. I'm not going to read the whole thing. Just want to decode heartbroken 54 like Jesuit order. You know, Central Intelligence Agency 117. So let's put this out. Heart also equals 54. Oh, excuse me. Love equals 54. Excuse me. I think of love, love, heartbroken, love, 5418, heartbroken, 54180. And again, they put Twitch here because again, murder numbers right there. And you died again, DJ40 died at 40. And then the LAPD, the LA County Coroner, they're the ones putting this out by the numbers. He began his DJ duties on the Ellen DeGeneres show in 2014. And again, his name equals 43. Stephen Boss equals 43, the 14 prime. Now he dies on the 14th day of the month. Supposedly, of course. I mean, that's what I'm saying. Guys could, guy, guy could either not die at all or could have died you know, months ago. Who knows at this point? They're giving you fake, fake information is what this proves. Fake information. Oh, they made a mistake. They didn't make a fucking mistake. So yeah, that's really it. Toxic work environment. I mean, that was all a, a, a mockery. Not not saying that she's not toxic, but that whole thing with Ellen DeGeneres toxic work environment. That was all. That was all just a play. But yeah, not, I'm not trying to make this video long. I'm trying to do more murder by numbers videos because they are my most popular videos on my channel. So I should you know lean into that. So I'm leaning into that. And some idiots like, oh, because you're trying to make money and views. No dumbass. I'm trying to promote this work. And if these are my most popular videos, and yes, I should do more of them. God. All right, so that's it. I'm going to link this in the description. Gamacho Effect News 25. Check out his channel. That's who wrote the, made this blog post. So he has a YouTube video on it. Again, don't sleep on this knowledge. This is exactly what they're doing. We'll look at his birth numerology just to finish off with some, some information. So 29th of September, 1982. Yeah, I mean, the guy has 38 birth numerology, 40. Let me look at this crap. 40 birth numerology. See, you see this shit. He dies at 40 years old. He's born 9, 29, 1982. 9 plus 2 plus 9 plus 1 plus 9 plus 8 plus 2 equals 40. And he's a DJ. You see how they script these people's lives, their birthdays is all by this code, DJ40. It's no, oh, really? It's, no, no, it's not me tapping into life and how it works and this is all... Imagine, no, this is literally scripted stuff from the Society of Jesus. That's why it works this way. This is how they scripted it. This might not even be his real birthday, but the birthday they give you, right, is coded. September 29th, 1982, it's coded at 40. He dies at 40. DJ 40. You see this shit? By the numbers. That's what I'm trying to show you. It's by the numbers. It's ritualistic. He even, he was born at it with 93 days remaining. The only day, day Malcolm X and, ML, and MLK met was the day with 93 numerology. They both died at 39, Black History Month 93, your Freemason 58, and 139. He's born with 58, 139 numerology. Don't be surprised if this guy was Boule. Your Blood Sacrifice 121, Illuminati 120. So yeah, I hope you get it now. I'm going to close the video. I always have an issue closing videos because I always close the videos like, oh, I should have talked about this. I should have decoded this. But you know what? The whole point is to show you what's going on, who's responsible. We sh I've shown you plenty of good information so far. If you have any questions, ask in the comments. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Take care. Peace out.